here we are with summertime rendering episode one and yeah if you want me to keep reacting to it leave a like subscribe or a comment let me know about it and yeah the only thing i know about this is basically the trailer or the trailers um i know that it's i don't know what it is it's like yeah on an island sister is gone or dead or whatever brother comes back i guess to the island where he come where he like was raised i guess born or whatever and there's some crazy weird shit going on that i think maybe some time travel stuff or whatever i don't know it's like weird um and yeah should be interesting heard lots of good uh, lots of good things about it yep and so yeah if you like what you see leave a like subscribe or comment let me know about it and i would say let's get to the episode so i guess he's already on his way back to the island maybe that's the sister right is the video fucked or is the weird static effect the anime yeah, I guess it's the anime. Protect Mio. Yo, hello. <laughs> and the slap. Okay. Deserved, I mean. <laughs> Even if he didn't didn't do it on purpose. Is it normal that he has two different eye colors, like one very bright blue and one like darker blue, or if this is or is this maybe the present his sister gave him? I think it was his sister, right? The blonde haired girl. I suck with names. I have to remember the name. Ushio. There's this girl. Oh, protect Mio. That's Mio. Did she say Oni-san? No, Shin-san. Okay. Hello. <laughs> Of course. <laughs> okay, so it's maybe not the sister. I thought the blonde girl was was his sister. I guess not. And on one side, I would like to live on an island like this. Must be really peaceful and all. But on the other side, I guess there's this girl again. Wait, what did she say? But on the other side, it's like, there's nothing going on, probably. And the internet is probably also not good. How's the shop doing? Oh, the, I bring it to you. You make most of your money during the summer break. So it's a funeral today? <clears throat> and the intro. But yeah, I feel like this might be one of those animes where I want to get all the information and don't want to miss anything because I guess because of how confusing it maybe will be, I want to understand as much as possible. And even when I get all the information, I probably will have a hard time figuring out what the fuck is going on because that's the whole point of the anime, I guess. That it's confusing and mysterious and all that stuff. I think this anime is a bit dark at times, but also somewhat like a sister, family. Who was that? <laughs> I guess this is like one of those situations where the Ushio, the girl, is like, 
probably in high regards by everyone because she was a nice girl and everything. And so it hit everyone really hard. Is this a coffin? Yeah, why would they need an autopsy for that, right? If it's more like an accident? Well, that's the girl she saved? Okay. She has dead eyes. The details. It wasn't an accident. Dum dum dum. Some curry? Yeah. Because that's what she wanted. So in her honor, memories, make he makes some curry. And I'm getting hungry. Quality wise, this looks so far really good. That's something that grabbed my attention that visually it looks really good. Um, so that was a weird scene, right? So maybe, like I said, I think there's some time travel Tom fuckery going on. So maybe that was not the Mio we saw in the building, but a second Mio maybe. Okay. I thought as much when he said Max. That. Hmm. That would be fucked up. Probably not. <laughs> Mio knows too. Who's Mr. Allen? She got accidentally strangled by something. <laughs> She's sad. Yeah, she knows. I mean, you know that she knows? <laughs> Your buddy, so I think was his name, just told you. Maybe he means in the sense of, does she know who it maybe was? I feel like animes like this is like, for me, kinda hard to react to, I would say, because I'm sitting here myself and be like, what is go in, in my head, what is going on? And I feel like to dissect everything in my head right now, because it's like, one of those animes that is like very mysterious. And so in my head, it's like the wheel spinning, right? What is going on? What could it mean? Now, like I said, we saw this one Mio and now we have maybe two Mios here right now. If there's time traveling shit going on, I don't know. I think there is. So it's like, is this a real one or is it not the real one? And because there's not much happening right now, it's really hard to like react to it much i would say glasses on honkers they grabbed my attention wait was it really wait wait wait, 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 wait. because i was talking i was distracted and didn't read is there maybe a second one of him already too or something okay <laughs> Being the only police officer must be interesting, right? Kobayakawa. 
vanished? Mm, I don't know. I would think that would be weird, right? Man, I'm getting hungry. What was that? Why did he look so suspicious? With the red filter over it? What did she say? Oh, are the... I mean, now we maybe saw already a double Mio, and we saw, the, or we heard, that there is a double Shinpei, maybe. So now there's the girl doppelganger. Shadow sickness. This is always, like, super freaky when you have, like, an island and there's some weird shit going on. That sounds super freaky. So maybe there's... I mean... <clears throat> maybe that's the time travel part, right? If there's time travel, I mean, I don't know. I think I've seen or heard something about time travel or something. I don't know. So maybe the people that time travel come back from the future or something and then kill themselves to take over or some shit? Wait, I didn't pay attention. What? what, 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 what? But it looks distorted, right? <laughs> this is some weird freaky shit. Makes me really wonder how everything turns out, right? Because from what I've heard, I just heard that many people say that it's really good. Does she see someone? The girl! Looked like the little girl. At the ponytails. The twin tails. To lure you, to lure you into a trap. <clears throat> a shot. The hunter. I would guess. The the woman. What is she doing? And she got hit. She didn't only got shot. She also got like sliced or some shit. Information? She? Huh? The double? And there's a time travel, travel, time travel part. So yeah, interesting episode. Not quite what I expected. But yeah, let me know if you want to see me keep reacting to this or not. Um, but yeah, um, like I said, not what I what I expected. I I mean, I knew that there is some dark stuff going on in this anime, and that it's like mysterious, and that there is some kind of time travel from what I've heard. Um, but I wasn't really sure about it, but I guess, yeah, there's some kind of time travel. Not really time travel, maybe, from what it seems like. If that's what at the end happened, is a time travel, travel part. Not really time travel, I would say. It's more, it feels maybe more like Groundhog Day. I think it's the name of the movie with Eddie Murphy. I think it's the actor. Um, or like maybe ReZero, where it's like you repeat the same day over and over and over and over again. And try to make progress right and then maybe maybe it's like groundhog day where it's like you have 
he revisits or he relives the ho same day over and over and over again, tries to make the progress and tries to solve the problem. Or maybe it's more like ReZero where it's like, you die, you make progress, you die, you make progress. And at some point, you if you get to a certain point, you have like a safe spot, basically. And when you die, you start from the safe spot and not from the very beginning again. And then you try to go from there and try to make progress again. So maybe it's one or the other. Uh, I guess I I would assume maybe it's more like ReZero, I would guess. Um, but yeah, not what I expected because I didn't expect it that the main character would die, basically in the first episode and then relives the first day or the same day the, his like um, his like day where he got to the island. I didn't expect that it would happen like that. Um, I thought he would go on living, and I didn't thought that shit would get so crazy at the end of the episode already at episode one i thought that maybe like the first few episodes are a bit more mysterious it has a slow start and then after a few episodes the crazy shit starts maybe but okay first episode and the crazy shit starts already and now i mean we know that there's a second meal and i guess now our main character has to be wary of meal right because he doesn't know is this a good meal or is this a, is this a bad meal right and now he is also cautious of the woman because she said she messed up and she wanted to tell him something and maybe he will like confront her and be like hey you wanted to tell me something because he maybe doesn't understand what is going on right away right maybe he thinks it was like a bad dream or something we will see how it turns out how he like processes this whole experience right when he wakes up now in the at the end and uh, in the next episode and I guess he will like come to the realization hey i experienced this already like he gets on the island and then mio comes with a bike down and crashes into the sea and he's like dude i experienced this already uh, so i guess he will be really confused and then slowly realize oh it happens again so yeah definitely interesting but like i said in the episode it's like kind of hard to react to animes like this i would say because of the nature that it's so mysterious right at times i'm just sitting here and want to absorb the information and like it happened in this episode quite a few times i'm talking about something while they say something and then i don't read properly i just fly over the text a bit don't catch everything and then suddenly i'm like hey wait, 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 let's get back because it's like mysterious and you want to absorb all the information because to understand what's going on or to get like clues and hints and everything right so you don't want to miss anything basically and at the same time, if I'm not talking, I'm not reacting, right? So at times I'm just sitting here and read everything, don't say anything, because in my head I'm reading and in my head I process all the information and try to figure out already what is going on, right? Um, so, and I don't want to sit here and like say everything I'm thinking about because that gets like super messy, I would say. So because of the nature of the anime, like I said, it's like, I would say kind of hard to react to it if you have because you have to react and talk to about it and there's so much going on because like i said you think about it and you process all the information so yeah um but i mean we will see how it turns out i guess if more stuff is happening and maybe more like action is happening then i guess it's gets easier it, it's it's more like the slow parts where you just get information and it's like slowly just information on the screen and then you think about that stuff i think those parts are the ones that are like hard to react to but when it comes to like with the action scenes it gets definitely easier when you just can talk about the stuff that is happening right now that is interesting right um, but yeah like i said we have to see how it goes and how it will turn out um but yeah if you like what you saw leave a like subscribe or a comment let me know if you want to keep me if you want me to keep reacting to it um, but yeah thanks for watching until next time Bye bye